Today we are going to review some shoes, but not Thank just you. any shoes. These are very special shoes. These are, Lincoln, do you know what the names of these are? Uh, these are the Nike Kalahaya, starts with a K, uh, Dornbacher, Nike Air Zoom Plus Dornbacher Kalalea Corona. Corona? It actually says Corona on it? Yeah. Corona. Did they name it that before Corona happened? These are not shoes for Lincoln or I, as you can tell. These are actually nurse shoes. These are the first shoes that Nike has ever made specifically for nurses or healthcare providers. Because yeah. there's a lot of unique challenges that healthcare providers see. You know, there's liquids that are on the floor that they might slip on. Um, there's liquids that might spill on their shoe, blood, urine. Lots of gross stuff. Nurses and doctors are some of the hardest working people that we have in the world, and they're working with 12 hour shifts, 24 hour shifts. And so it needs to be something that's comfortable because they're on their feet a lot. So that's what Nike did when they made this shoe in 2019. But after they were made, a um, little thing happened called a coronavirus, COVID-19. Coronavirus. 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 To be specific, COVID-19. When that happened, Nike was sitting there looking at their stockpile of these shoes. They had 30,000 shoes and they decided, you know what? That's a lot. Rather than sell these to nurses, why don't we uh, give them away? They got them set up so that they could send them to some of the hospitals that were hit hardest. Really, really cool thing. Well, of course, yeah. right when we saw that, I'm like, I need to see these shoes. We need to review them. We need to see what's inside of them. In order to give this a true test, we need to give them to a nurse. Fortunately, Lincoln and I know a nurse. Our employee, Hunter, who's awesome. Hi, Hunter. His wife is a nurse in the ICU at Intermountain Hospital here in Utah. It's pretty cool that Hunter's wife, Tate, works for Intermountain Healthcare because Intermountain Healthcare is the sponsor of today's video. COVID-19 has been quite a challenge for all the communities around the United States, even here in Utah. Despite all the challenges with COVID-19 going on right now in our community and across the United States, it is reassuring to know that Intermountain Healthcare is open and and ready to safely care for us. One thing to remember, just because COVID-19 is really strong right now, it's really important that people don't delay their important health care needs. If you have tightness of chest or shortness of breath, or you have signs of a stroke, make sure that you get checked out at the hospital. They are prepared to take care of you in a very safe, very clean, sanitary way. Don't be afraid to go to the hospitals if you have severe issues with your health. Intermountain Healthcare has multiple ways to take care of you, whether it's a video visit, whether it's a drive-through visit. They even have COVID-19 testing centers that are outside of their hospital. Click on the link in the description to learn more about Intermountain Healthcare's Always Here For You campaign. So before we dive deep into this shoe and take it apart, let's take it to an Intermountain Healthcare employee. Let's let them try it out for two weeks and let's see what she thinks about this. So uh, let's go. Let's deliver some shoes to a nurse. That sounds fun. All right, we made it. We got the shoes. We got the shoes. Yes. This is it. Hello. We've got hey. Hunter. Hi. That's not what you're supposed to say, Lincoln. What are you supposed to say? Hi, Hunter. Hi, Hunter. So these are the nursing shoes right here. Tate, you are a nurse at Intermountain Healthcare. Okay, grab those shoes, take a look at them, and uh, we're gonna keep a safe six feet distance. Woo! Oh, actually, those are really cool. <laughs> they have little nursing cuties on them. Have you ever seen anybody using those? I have not. What you kind of shoes people. do you wear right now? I wear these. They're, they're Nikes too, but they're super old and kind of falling apart. I've had them for like six years. <laughs> they don't look like they're so made they're for close. nursing. Yeah. No, these look like they'll be really cool. So Tate's gonna try these on and uh, for two weeks, Yeah. give it a shot. Sweet. And then we want honest feedback. This video is not sponsored by Nike. We bought these shoes and they were not cheap because we got them on StockX. So they're like three to $500 just for these shoes. That's not what Nike was selling them for before, but because Nike is giving all 30,000 of them to nurses around the world, there's really none available for people like me or other nurses that just wanna buy them because they're, maybe their hospital didn't get them. So she's gonna take these to work for two weeks and then we will follow up in this video. All right, goodbye. Okay, this is not something that I do very often, but it is uh, six in the morning and I'm up early. We gave the shoes to Tate. Um, it has not been two weeks. It's actually been a month and a half. And uh, we wanna go and check on her and see what she thinks about them. The tricky part is Tate, like many nurses, works the night shift. So she goes to work at 6.30 p.m. and she leaves and goes home at 6.30 a.m. So we need to be there at 6.30 a.m. at the hospital to get her review of the shoes because for her, it's time to go home be there for a few hours and go to sleep for the night. And we wanna make sure that she gets her sleep. 
right now it is a Sunday morning and it's actually Father's Day today so I know this is late when you're seeing this but happy Father's Day to all the fathers that are out there wanted to do something a little extra nice for Tate and for her nursing unit so I got $540 in gift cards to some of my favorite restaurants in town. It is good to do nice things for nurses. They work so hard and they do an important job that not a lot of us could ever do. I know when we had our kids, I thought to myself, I am so grateful for nurses. I can't believe they're here and they're doing this job, which wasn't, to me, the most exciting job. And you gotta think about the things that they see in the hospital when you're at your worst. Because we're out in public and we want to be safe, I did get a mask, so we will wear a mask when I see her today. And uh, let's go find Tate. Check it out. There is Tate, the nurse. And let's see, you've got Ooh, the shoes on down so here. Nice. How are they holding up They're after holding a few up weeks? Great. Yeah, I, I like them a lot. I've had them all broken in now. They're working pretty good. They're pretty comfortable. They're kind of a mix between a clog and a normal sneaker, so I don't have any problem running around in them. Do your <laughs> shoes get nasty stuff on them as a nurse? You know, I, unfortunately, sometimes they do. What have people thought about the shoes? Other nurses, doctors, anybody say anything about them? Yeah, almost everybody. And sometimes my patients are like, oh, your shoes are so cute. How do they so compare so to your other ones that were um, just regular Nike shoes that were not made for nursing? They are different, they're more comfortable I usually can't wear Nikes because I have like, I need like arch support. I like like Asics. But these have helped a lot actually. They feel good on the balls of my feet. They feel nice and padded. We're on our feet for 12 hours a day. So we need a lot of support. This is Tate's shoe. I'm gonna take it off and make her go barefoot for a second. <laughs> and I'm gonna get really far away so I can take off my mask. It's held up pretty well. Do I dare smell oh, it? No. <laughs> it is dirty, but I think most of that's just from the asphalt that we're standing on right now. It looks brand new and clean on the top, and she's been wearing this on four 12-hour shifts a week, and I'm impressed. They've held up really well. This is some sort of plastic on the outside that makes it so you can wipe it off really easily, and I do like what she said about the inside of it, that the it has really good support for her foot. You can see that support like in the arch area and then in the balls of her feet. Um, it does have enough cushioning that she said that it's safe. And then on the bottom, this is like a stick-free material so that nurses, when they're walking on different types of flooring, whether it's slippery or whatever, it should be a non-slip type of material on the bottom, which are some things that you don't get just from a regular shoe. And unfortunately, a lot of nurses just wear normal shoes because they get what they can afford and get what's available. Um, the back of these shoes are kind of weird. Do you like the way that they are? Is it easy to get on and off? I do. I usually, my old shoes, I would just step on the backs because I would try and get out in a hurry. But these are so nice. They're super easy to take on and off. You just kind of like slip them on. Is it too tight back there? No, it's not. But I super like it a lot because it grips onto the back of your feet so you can run around the unit and them and they still work. Okay, she's had a few weeks to try these shoes on and she's got them here. Now we gotta know, what is your rating out of 10? How would you rate these shoes? For a nursing shoe, I think 10 out of 10. 10 I think out of 10, they're, really? They're better than I've ever tried before. The premise of this video is to take these shoes off and to cut them in half. Are you okay with me taking them apart? If it must be done, it can be done. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a change in plans a little bit. I think Tate loves these shoes. She is a nurse. I don't see how I can take the shoes off of her feet that she likes as a nurse and shoes that we can't get again and cut them open. So yeah, this is this video is on the family channel. We are not gonna cut open those shoes. Um, you can keep the shoes. Woohoo! Thank you! <laughs> that actually makes me so happy. <laughs> how many nurses do you have on your floor? Ooh, you depends on the day, but like per day, there's like 20 on okay. the floor. 20? Maybe. Cool. That's a lot. I don't know if this is going to work, but here's some gift cards. Oh my heck. This is a lot Thank of gift you. cards. If you could give that to like oh. one to every nurse. Yes, I can do that. Does that work? <laughs> that works. Okay. Thank you. Thank you to Intermountain Healthcare for sponsoring this video. If you have a chance, go do something nice for a nurse. There are so many of them out there and they are literally on the front lines of this pandemic, helping to make sure that we all stay safe. As a reminder, like I said earlier, if you have some serious health issues, if you have a shortness of breath, chest pains, 
a signs of a stroke, whatever it may be, don't just stay at home because you're scared of going to the hospital because maybe there's some coronavirus patients there. The hospital is doing all that they can right now to make sure that every patient can go in safely. They're sanitizing the rooms, they're taking care of everything. The nurses have their face masks on, they wash their hands between every visit or they have gloves on. It is a safe place. Make sure that you take care of yourself and Intermountain Healthcare is here for you. For now at 6.30 in the morning, we're gonna let Tate finish her shift and go back home. We wanna say thank you to the nurses that are working really, really hard to make sure that we fight this coronavirus safely. And also we gotta give big kudos to Nike for giving away 30,000 of these nursing shoes. Their entire inventory just giving them away to nurses. I wish they had a few hundred thousand more because there are definitely a lot of nurses that could benefit from these Nike shoes. Maybe they'll make more that they can sell or maybe they'll make more that they can give away. But for now, very cool shoes, 10 out of 10. Good job, Nike. These are not shoes for Lincoln or I, as you can, whoa, the bulb died. <laughs>